we're back for another video. So we got Huddy. And the Chili King. And the Chili King, and, and uh, we decided to do something a little different tonight. We had uh, this suggested to us by Asher Dopel's dad, Brad. Yep. And he said we should try the new Pringles flavors. And I, I'm assuming they're all new. They It says new on them. So I'm going with new. We also decided while we were at Walmart to try the Mountain uh, Dew black Mountain and white see. label. Yeah, you may not be able to see that, but Huddy's got a Mountain Dew black label and I got a Mountain Dew white label. I'm going to be crazy. I've already yes. had the black label, so I decided to try the white label. Let's open them and get them ready. All right, let's, let's try that. <laughs> Also, I'm sporting the uh, First Methodist Church No Negative November shirt. No Negative November. And uh, I need to not be negative. <gasps> Smells good. All right, we'll try. We're not gonna try that until after oh. eat, eat something. So well, here's what we've decided to do. We got five flavors. We got Super Cheesy Italian, Super Cheesy Italian, and we're gonna have a glare today. It looks like we've got the Margarita Pizza. Mighty margarita pizza. Oh, it's mighty margarita. I don't know, but Hudson loves margarita pizza. Mm. We got salsa fiesta. Spicy queso. Spicy queso, not just queso. And, and then fiery chili. Fiery chili lime. lime, which I swore I'd never eat another one of, but I guess I'm going to today. So, so we've put them in <laughs> we've put them in mildest to what we think is hottest. We're not sure, and we're gonna go mild first. And we're gonna let that build, okay? Let through. We're gonna let the heat build. So we're gonna we're gonna do them. Why is it opening? We're, here, let me. Do it. We're gonna we're gonna eat eat a couple of each, and then we won't grate it till the end. Okay, I need to get them these. Okay. So so I'll let Hudson have the first one. This is super cheesy that. Italian. Yeah, my, look, mine's a, it's a half really a yellow. It's that's not yellow. It's kind of green. It's kind of greeny. It's kind of guacamole looking, but okay. Super cheesy Italian. Let's Cheers. try it. Hmm. <laughs> that tastes like that tastes like Italian seasoning, which makes sense. I don't taste any cheese. Do you? I taste some taste some cheese. I taste garlic. That's really good. I don't know how I feel about that yet. Do we want, do you want to just grate them as we do them? Would that make it easier? Yeah. Okay. I hate to do that though, because what if you eat the next one and you go, oh, I gave that a five, and that's it. Let's wait till the end. Sure. Okay. So put the top on that. So super cheesy Italian, to me, it strangely tastes like a breadstick, kind of. Kind of, but with a lot, a lot of garlic. And garlic. A lot of garlic. A lot. Of, if you've ever cooked with that Italian seasoning, that's what that tastes like. Let's cleanse the pilot. Yeah, we're gonna need to cleanse it. All right, so let's try this. Oh crap! <laughs> Stupid. Let me go grab a napkin, anyways, okay, guys. And just like that, he's gone. Okay, those are not very cold, but the white label Mountain Dew is, is a crafted tropical citrus, whereas the black label is a crafted dark berry. So I guess Mountain Dew is now making like crafted drinks, like crafted beers. <laughs> okay, so here, we're gonna try the Mighty Margarita Pizza next. That's the first time we've left the screen. <laughs> All right, so Mighty Margarita Pizza. Look, there it is. I think this will be really We good. like Margarita Pizza, so we're hoping for the best here. Cheers. Okay, immediately I taste that margarita sauce that's on the Margarita Pizza. I don't taste any. I don't really taste any. What? Okay, so if you've ever had a margarita pizza, you know it's it's mostly sauce with the little pieces of basil and uh, mozzarella cheese. I don't taste any basil. I don't taste cheese at all. I don't know about basil, but I definitely taste the sauce, and I think that's probably what yeah. they're going for. Yeah. <laughs> and that doesn't taste that much different than the other one. It's got a lot of Italian seasoning in it too. 
It really. I thought that would be better than it is. Let's move that out of the way. All right, so next we're going with the Salsa Fiesta. Yes. Let's take a drink of our awesome handcrafted Mountain Dew products. Also owned by Pepsi. Mm, I like it. <clears throat> it's different. Okay, so this is Salsa Fiesta. Yeah, Salsa Fiesta. I'm assuming this is going to taste like salsa. Don't you think? It smells like salsa. Oh my gosh. Taste the jalapeno and onions. Mm -hmm. I, exactly, I do too. Don't taste. It's a little spicy, but not real spicy. I like it. That's my favorite so far. It tastes exactly like salsa. Give me time. That has, that, if you've ever had any kind of salsa chips, like tortilla chips, that's a lot like that. what that tastes like. It was really good. I, I, I like that one the best. Okay, so this is not coming off properly. Okay, this is the spicy queso. It's got a little jalapeno kicking over here, so I'm assuming this is going to be a little bit hotter. This one did too. Oh, did it? Right there. Yeah, I see it. And the onion. I may have had these. It says new though. But maybe haven't. Cheers. So this is um, spicy queso. That's I actually like that one better. It's not that spicy. It's not, and I don't know why they're called loud. <laughs> it's really not that loud. Because it's not that loud. <laughs> it's a. Uh, uh, actually, this, the Salsa Fiesta is better than this. This is okay. When I think queso, I think a strong cheese flavor. I don't taste strong cheese. Do you? I don't taste any cheese. That's the first one yet. That one, I didn't taste any cheese. I mean, I taste a little cheese, but not a lot. It's not, I'm not, thinking like okay. pretty hot, but like so much cheese. So much. So Those, much. Those are disappointing. I'm just going to be honest. Mm. Okay. Have you got a drinking problem? Yeah. Woo. Okay. So, fiery chili lime. Now, if you heard the other video where I talked about the Takis, I said I would never eat fiery chili lime stuff again, but I'm about to. I see a chili and a lime. Maybe they won't be hot. Let me just tell you, I love that flavor, but my body doesn't. <laughs> That's a good one. Oh, he's touching them all. That smells that, hot. It does smell hot. So let's see. Not that hot. Oh, I can taste that lime. Yeah, you can really taste the lime. Ooh. It's the prominent flavor in that. That's not very good, actually. Well, now here comes the heat. The heat came at the end. That, it tastes exactly... Well, it doesn't taste. It doesn't good. taste like a taki. It tastes a little bit like but, a taki. But Taki's got a sweeter, a and, and a taki has a sweeter flavor. That's not sweet. No, that's not good. That's the worst one. It's not the worst one. It is the worst one. I'm gonna get one I, more. I, I really like these. Here, eat one more. Get you one with a lot of stuff on it. It's got, it's got a lot of stuff on it. It's, Ooh, right there. And it's hot. Like, it doesn't start hot, but it creeps up on you. No. I don't like that. All right, bring them back over here. So, we're going to we're gonna grade these down the line. I'm going to be honest. I'm, I'm pretty disappointed. I love Pringles. I love different flavors of chips. None of these really were that good to me. The, I, I thought those were probably the salsa. Best. Yeah, I agree. Salsa fiesta to me is by far the best. Okay, so let's go down the line. Remember, one is terrible, five is great, two and a half is average. Remember that, okay? I know. All right, let me get a little drink because my mouth is burning. This salsa one wasn't that hot, actually. And the white label Mountain Dew is pretty good, but I don't know if I'll ever get that again either. Okay, so we're going to start with a super cheesy Italian. Which I said tasted kind of like a breadstick. I like breadsticks. Okay, what would you give it? 4.35. It was pretty good. Okay. Mm. I'm not going anywhere near that high. I'm, I'm giving that about a 2.75. What? 
You didn't like it? No. Remember, 2.5 is average. I, I thought it was okay. It tastes a little bit like a breadstick. It's got a heavy garlic flavor. I couldn't eat many of those. I'd be stinking. Oh, I, I could eat those. <laughs> All right, so so you gave it a 4.35. I gave it a 2.75. I would huh. I would probably never buy that again. The Mighty Margarita Pizza flavor. What would you give that? 3.5. I would give that a 2. It was it was not good to me. You can taste you, the margarita sauce. But you couldn't taste anything else. Yeah, but that was about it. And to me, it was not good. And I like margarita pizza. I just didn't, not, didn't work for me. Okay, so the Salsa Fiesta, which I thought was the best one. Five. Okay, he gives it a five. I yeah. give that a four. And I, and it is, it is good. I would, I would, that probably the only one of these I would buy again. Really? Yes. This is good. It tastes like salsa. And usually the other Pringles don't taste exactly. That tastes like salsa. That's correct. That's really good. I give it a four. You give it a five. That's fine. Okay, so spicy queso, which is probably my second favorite, even though I didn't really like it. Uh, I would give it 3.25. I would give it a three. It. I wouldn't buy it again, probably. I would get, I'll tell you what I would get instead of that. I would get their cheese, just their regular cheese flavored. Oh, I love which them. Which I, I do too. I love them. This isn't as good as that. I like the off-brand ones. <laughs> We're not talking about off-brand Pringles today. But they're good. But we love some off-brand fake Pringles. Okay, so in the end, we're going fiery chili, fiery chili lime, which I thought would be my least favorite, and it was. What would you give that? One. I would give it a one as well. To me, it's not good. It's hot. It's too hot. It's not good. And it doesn't taste anything it, like... It doesn't taste like I thought it would, it, it, I agree. And, and when I say it's hot, it doesn't start hot. But each of about five of them and see what happens. <laughs> it's pretty hot. Like, my mouth is burning right now. So, what would you give the Mountain Dew... Black Label. Crafted Blackberry... Excuse me. Crafted Dark Berry Black Label 16-ounce beverage. Four, I'll get it. You give it a four? Okay, so I got the white label, which is a crafted tropical citrus. <clears throat> I would give that about a three also. I need it, to try that. It, you're not drinking after me. I'm not going to drink. Can you pour it in a cup? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. I'm just a little bit of a germaphobe. That was okay. I would never get that again either. I'd rather just have regular Mountain Dew. No, that's good. I you like that a, better. I like that better than this. You've been a Debbie Downer the whole time. I know, I'm not real excited about my grades, but I'm telling you, th these are very disappointing. I would have rather, I would rather have had five of their original, like the normal flavors. Like the cheese, the regular. Buffalo. Buffalo. The buffaloes are some, I like the cheeseburger. The salt and vinegar. Oh my God. Yeah, any of those are better than really any of these. This is the only one that I would recommend. If you like hot stuff, get the Takis, don't get those. Like these <laughs> He'll probably eat. I'm probably not going to eat any more of these. I'll probably eat most of these. Okay, while we were buying these, we also got several different flavors of Pop-Tarts. Pop-Tarts. And we hope to, to review those soon. Soon. Really soon. Soon. So, Hudson's about to go spend the night with one of his buddies. I'm off work tomorrow, so I'm going to relax tonight. And right now, the, my wife is at Little Tots, our preschool. By the way, this video is brought to you by Little Tots. Brought to you by Little Tots. Yeah, product of Little Tots. We're, yes. We're going, uh, we're going to open back up the same day that city schools start, which is August 9th. So, at the end of this video, I'll include the contact information if you would like to have your child in our preschool. We would love to have you. Please sign up. Yeah. <laughs> so, tonight's orientation. They're orientating the people that have already signed up. But you can sign up any time between now and the end of next school year. We'd love to have you. Right? Yes. Okay, so we're going to sign off on that note so he can go get ready to go to his friend's house. Okay. And I'm probably going to watch the Braves. Braves. I didn't even know they played tonight. They play the Dodgers again. All right, so. And they're going to be in. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. All right. Stay away from these. Get regular Pringles. These are good. <laughs>